Welcome back everybody, some more everybody's golf on PlayStation 4, carrying on our DLC series with the custom clubs, Balata Country Club, Inward 9. Um, I managed to break my custom clubs in the last episode, uh, which basically means you can't see the flag marker on your power meter, uh, which is, makes life considerably more difficult. So what we're going to do is use my other set of custom clubs. Uh, so my custom twos are broken. So I'm going to play my custom ones, uh, which are level 21. So they'll be slightly longer, but it won't make that much difference. Okay, so first hole. Oh, that pins in an interesting spot with the wind. Um, there's a real chance of pitching into that sand if we're not careful. So what we're going to try and do... Oh, it's not mucked that up. That's too short. Masterful. Try to put a little bit of bend on it to keep it out of the way of the bunker, but the, oh, is that going to go? Yeah, the rough's got it. It's just too short. That was a mistake. So that's going to make for an interesting second shot. We've got a bit over 30 yards to go. But at least we can see the flag marker. Let's see if we can get it up. Get it on the green at least. Good, good. Yeah, it's on. That's puttable. So, nine foot putt. For a buddy. Sloping downhill. Focus. Right, to the I was messing with my camera last time I played. You can get right down there if you want. Um, and the reverse angle, but I like this angle best. So, right edge of the cup. Just under hit it a smidgen because it's downhill. And that should drop. Teeny cups, by the way. So, getting close to the hole is going to be absolutely vital in this round. Uh, it's regular tees and teeny cups. So, Putting's going to be tricky. Hole 11. It's a par four. It's a hole 11. Nice straight par four. However, comma, you've got those two bunkers there if you do make a mistake. And as we've seen, I'm a little bit prone to mistakes. So let's not make one. So let's get it up there. No spin on it. But I think it's going to pitch on that upslope of the fairway. So it should kill it anyway as it comes in. There we go. Oh, I just ran a bit far. Stop. Just out the back. But a 12 yard pitch back. And again, it's going to roll to the right. So let's just give it a chance. Pitch. And in the hole. There we go. Chipping eagle and teeny cups. That's pretty tough, but you know. I'll take it. So we get our eagle. You should get like a bonus because it's up. It's like an official, but it's a hard official eagle. Hole twelve is a par three. It's hole twelve. Hole twelve, par three. Bit of crosswind. Yeah, a bit of room to play with, but not much. It's a little bit downhill, so got a little bit of spin on it, but not what I wanted. Oh, is this gonna land? Gonna land on the green Champion. just? Oh, that's not bad at all. Amazing. Very puttable, even with teeny. Buddy. So, left edge for sure. A little bit firm. But a bit of luck. Take our birdie. Yeah. So, four on. That's a good start. Let's hope we can keep that up. It's a good it's a good pacey start. So, par five. Oh, it's a par five. Again, it's pretty straight, but it's got a few little kinks in it. So this is all about where you're going to land it. So it's downhill. So let's go for about there. Try and get it over those trees. Go! Masterful! And it's all about where it's going to roll to. Well, that's not bad. I'm, I'm getting in range of those guys with the long drives. So 47 to go. A little bit of tail. It's going to roll right when it lands. But it needs a little bit of elevation. So this time we'll try and backspin. It got the ultra backspin. So if we're up near the pin, Ooh. we are. Spin back. Look at that. will do me. Three foot hop. Don't let the eagle slip. Eagle. So we're going to go slightly outside the edge of the car. And a bit like that will just break and drop. Like that. Oh. Oh. And I think about lipping out there. But we'll take the eagle. So that's a great start. Two birdies, two eagles to start with teeny cups. But again, oh, I've been 40. landing it pretty close it's to the hole. And that's the key. So, par four. Again, it's another one of those ones with water. But we can drive it this time. We don't need to lay up. 
So there's a bit of a headwind. So let's go for there. And again, it's a one wood, so we're going to have to stop it. Ah, oh, missed the, missed the backspin. Oh, so this is going to run. Now that may be to our advantage, because I think, oh. yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Lucky bounce. The water takes a fair bit off it. That's okay. 15 oh, foot. For the eagle. Okay, so it's a long way downhill and it's going to break Stop right. I've got to be really Breaking careful. To I don't want to run too far. Maybe about that. That may even be over here. And then it rolled. Yeah, look at that. It's just going right past. Those downhill putts are absolutely lethal. Oh, that buddy. It's a six footer. Just outside the left edge, I think. Hopefully we can take the birdie. Yeah. A birdie. Get birdie. Okay. Oh, 50. So hold 15. It's a and again, with the length we've got, we can drive up and get a sort of, you know, drive the green. Again, that bunk is the thing we've got to be concerned with. So we could shape it left to right a little bit, which is what we might do. What we're trying to do really is, is come in at a different angle. So with a bit of luck, we don't clip that bunker. Ooh. Where's that going to end up? That's not bad at all. So that gives us 12 foot for the eagle. Now, this is harder than it looks. It's an even break. Breaking to the left. You've got to read it. You've got to read it. Maybe a cut right. Maybe a cut right. Come back, come back, come back. Yeah, there we go. Another eagle. But again, you know, you've got to get your first shot close. You can't leave yourself. You know, 12, 15 foot putts on Patini cups are hard. Whereas on normal cups, you wouldn't worry about a 12 or 15 foot. You'd be ah, fine, I can hit that. So another par three. So headwind and it's close to the front edge and that slope equals water. So I want to pitch past it for absolute certain. So I want to overhit this and backspin it. And we got the ultra backspin. The question is, the wind's taking it left a bit, but we're on. We got it stopped. I'll take that. Roll with it. It's a seven foot. Go for the birdie. Bit of break. It's probably about half a cup left. Hit it firm. And that might be another birdie. Get in there. So some good putting today, but set up by some, some good approach play. You know, it makes it easier if you're close. So we've got a 4-5 finish. Hole 17. It's a par Again, four. Another straightish hole, but we're into the we're into the wind this time and it's uphill. So I might use the power shot here just because I'm not too sure I've got the length to get up there. Didn't manage to get any spin on it, but it's going to hit that surface there and it should slow it. Question is, will it roll to the right? It will. So that's a mistake. We're in the first cut of the rough. So it's going to kick right. We want to land to the left for sure. And let's see if we can get it up. So it's going to lose a bit of power. So we can just roll it. Go on. Oh, just a bit fast, I think, actually. Let's have a look at that again. Is that just a bit quick? Yeah, a bit slower. That might have just, the whole might have just taken it. So it was the pace was the failure there. Sloping down, I think. Okay, so we've got to be careful. It's going to break left, and we've got to be gentle with it. Let it fall in. Just like that. We've got our birdie. Takes us to 11 under. And the par 5 to come. This will be the last. And you can see the difference having, having the custom clubs made. It just changes how you play this course. Now there's no way you can drive that. So again, we'll just, we'll just lay up, I think. Um, what we don't want to do is roll into the water. Which hopefully I haven't done. Where's that going to land? Yeah, you need to stop. You need to stop. You need to stop. Now I've ended up in the rough. Never mind. So it's going to make the second shot harder. We've talked about that. So we've got two issues here. One is we won't get the spin because of the light and we'll lose the power. So wind's going to take it to the right, but then the slope's to the left as well. Okay, it's uphill. So we need to be about there. Try and get some spin on it just to hold oh, it. Nice shot. But again, it's an approach wedge. Good Shouldn't good. roll too far. That's nice. 
to seven foot for an eagle. Ride that eagle. Oh, that slope. Look at that slope. Easy now. So, oh, maybe there. Waking to the left. About three, three and a half cups. And let's hit it firm. And with a bit of luck, that'll just drop in. Go on. Yes, yes. eagle finish. So that's a fantastic round, really. 13 under. But again, set up by getting those getting those putts as short as I can. Look at all those putts. Nine foot, 11 foot. Two foot, three foot, five foot, eleven. You know, it, it's nothing outside of twelve foot. You know, that's the that's the secret to be inside twelve foot. Seventeenth uh, on the day, thirteen. Someone got sixteen under. I'm, I'm pleased with that. If I'm honest, I'm very pleased with that. So that's not bad at all. And our stat should reflect that as well. That we, did, we did reasonably well there. Yeah. Impact foam, it's greens. Yeah, we hit, hit all of our greens. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. We'll carry this series on. Um, please like, share and subscribe. And I've got my golf level back. Back to level 15. Thank you very much. Uh, and I'll see you next time for a bit more of his golf.